everybody, welcome to another edition of the Magic Show. I'm uh, that, that was Eleven Irwin there from Old School Magic Show. If you guys remember that, thank you guys for uh, for being here. We are gonna play some standard. Uh, this is a deck that uh, Danny Bambino sent me the other day. Uh, it got four Lanowar Elves, three Paradise Druid, four Thorn Lieutenant, four Hydrid Crassus. Thorn Lieutenant's nice. Two Deputy, eight three mana Planeswalkers here. <laughs> four Night Pack Ambusher. Which I love. Two Frilled Mystic, which I love. So all of your creatures have Flash, or they get Flash through Vivian. And then you got three Toll Smears, and one Nyssa, and like 25 lands? So, we'll see. You're basically saying, I can cast all my spells at instant speed, and you can cast none of yours at instant speed. That's the goal. And then for the sideboard, we have two Veil of Summer, two Baffling End, two Disdainful Stroke, two Negate, two Prison Realm, two Settle, one Vivian, and two Carnage Tyrant. Lots of two ofs. <laughs> I like that. Yeah, this is good. I'm officially sick of a lot of cards in standard, but, you know, I feel like I've uh, I've mentioned this before, so. Not going to go on, not going to get on that soapbox, I guess. You know who I'm sick of? Tell me. Is it going to be me? It's going to be me, isn't it? I'm listening though. Name starts with a T and ends with Effery. Dang. This hand would be good except for these lands. Oh, this hand would be good except for no lands. Yeah, all right, we'll keep it. We'll put one Glacial back and one Hinterland Harbor back. Actually, maybe we keep one of these. Put the Karasas back, all right. Ugh, I don't know if I like that better, but I do like, I do like this mulligan roll. It's really nice. You can just sculpt a decent hand. Dang it! You know what I'm not tired of? Yeah, Danto Vanguard. That guy's fine. You got to accentuate the positive. we block here? I'm pretty sure we block here. I don't like any of the- I don't like any of our options here. Sure. Oh, are you casting it on the 10th District Legionnaire? Fascinating. And you're gonna pay four? Sure. You got it. Can you update the stream? Oh my god. Not right now because I I didn't I didn't save the deck. Dang it, Lance. That's so Lance like. This deck is really aggressive. I'm sick of aggro decks. Yeah, well. Three, six, seven, eight, nine. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna concede here because then we go to one. I don't think we're actually winning this game. Um. So here's the thing. I've heard people sick of control decks. I've heard them sick of the combo deck that is uh, Nexus of Fate. And I've heard them sick of aggro decks, right? And I think these are all viable. Like, I, this is funny because you just you just think those, those people are just upset about these archetypes. I don't think that's true. I think they're all viable complaints. And I think the reason is because all of the, the versions of these decks, control, aggro, combo are all really extreme versions of those decks in this format for some reason.
actually don't think these planeswalkers are great in this matchup. I don't think you're great in this. Dang it. I also, here's a hot take. I also don't think there's as much skill required in standard currently. And what I mean by that is that if you're playing a deck like mono blue, like the mono blue tempo deck, and I'm playing a control deck, right? Um, a lot of it comes down to if I have Kaya's Wrath and if you have a counter spell. If you don't, I'm going to kill all your guys. If you do, I'm not going to kill all your guys, right? There's no real, like, strategy. Like, it's it's not... Being able to play around your opponent in those situations is not as easy, I guess. It just doesn't... I, I don't know. There's not as much play. Oh, I guess Andrew's going to be here in, like, 15 minutes. A 15 a minute. <laughs> Yeah, the, the, the majority of turns seems practically scripted right. Like, And I think, like, most combo decks, like, if I'm playing against a Storm deck, if I'm playing against Through the Breach, something like that, right, then if my opponent combos out, like, I lose in, like, three minutes. Max. Whereas, like, if I'm playing against Nexus of Fate, I literally have to wait for 15 minutes and hope they can kill me. Because maybe they can't. You know, like, it's also the time commitment. Like, the combo the combo deck in Standard doesn't actually kill you quickly. It kills you very slowly. And so you just have to sit there and wait because you're never, you're never sure, am I dead? And a lot of times people are just con conceding because they just don't want to deal with it. And I think that's a bad place to be. Like, you don't want people conceding because they're just annoyed. I wonder that too. That's actually a good question, Josh. Definitely need a white source here. I don't think the Polyraptor combo is actually a thing, because Polyraptor costs like 8 mana. So your odds of keeping a 2 mana creature alive, uh, and then also playing an 8 mana spell that combos with it, is I think they're pretty slim. Which is why you also don't see that deck. Like, that's not a thing. I mean, it is a, it is a combo, but you just don't see that doing anything. I gotta accentuate the positive. Hunter's panting quite heavily because of the, the thunder that he just heard. Get him. Double block? How much do you value your feather? How much do you value your feather? That's not even a, that's a weird voice. I don't know what it's doing. I oh, was just taking four. What's your favorite deck you played so far? Anything you take definitely? Nah, uh, I don't even know actually. Oh, I guess we just win this game. I guess wolves are OP.
don't hate this hand. No Vivian? What do you mean? What are you asking me here? Vivian Reed? She seems a little slow. I've done some tuning on my Sakdos deck, and it's like almost playable. Like a 40 45% win rate or something last night. Is that where we want to be? Is that where we want to be, Josh? I gotta accentuate the positive. Bant Ramp was super fun. I, I I didn't I didn't mind that deck, but I haven't found something that I'm like really like that I really enjoy. Undrep Tuna, what's going on, buddy? Happy Friday. You know, Friday. Well. What, 13 already? That seems like... Not a lot. Settle the wreckage. Goodbye. I'll see you later. Bye. I got to accentuate the positive. Where did all your creatures go? I got another feather to play against you. I'm gonna play this and then pass the turn right back. Do -do 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 -do. So we're gonna, we're gonna ambush her, and then next time we're gonna be we're gonna be Crassison. Oh look, the same two creatures they had. That's great. It's almost like they, uh... It's almost like they never didn't have those. Pro green, huh? Okay. I mean, Infinite God's Willings is pretty unbelievably good. Like, it's really hard to deal with that. Us gaining two life is not going to do it. So, the God's Willing is still in exile, right?
was a weird choice. Um, they have God's Willing, we know that. One, two, three, four, five. We are too shy of actually playing Tulsimir and Deputy in the same turn. God's Willing is actually a real hard card to get around here. But we do gain three, I believe. Sure. That was actually a good play because now we have to target the feather. Thank you. Alexa, stop. Target up to one creature. No, we don't submit zero. Yeah, mine woke up too, so I have no idea what I said there. Alexa, make a fart noise. I don't know what she said. No. <laughs> oh, we have a good time. Mystic's a hell of a magic card, guys. Let's see. Let's see what this Andrew's doing. Oh, 15 minutes. He said that 12 minutes ago. The last thing I need of screaming is like, <laughs> oh, kids. Oh, kids. Am I right? Oh, what a little scamps. Is Frilled Mystic better than Mystic Snake? You shut your mouth. How dare you? I'm going to time you out. Timed out. No, I don't think so. I think th I think the, the, the ease of casting Mystic Snake, uh, even if it's just one mana, is more relevant than the one power. Oh god, I'll keep it. You know what? We could draw things. We're gonna we're gonna have a good time. Why isn't the art for Soren on the play seal to have so much better why is the art why isn't the art for Sauron so much better than the one that is on the actual Soren card? You mean why is, right? Um Because art is subjective, that's why. That's my answer to that. Got him. We're playing against the old Snudger. You know, you guys know Snudger. Frilled Mystic is a Lizard Wizard, which is <laughs> Lizard, Liz Wiz, uh, which is not irrelevant. I agree with you. 
John, what's going on, buddy? Always good to see you. Always good. To I don't actually know if I'm excited for fairies coming to standard in the pulse set. I have bad experiences with fairies. Okay. Um, that's a good amount of lands. Although I like this bag of holding over here. <laughs> oh god. Which I assume they will activate. Bag of holding is like a card you activate every chance you get because it just rewards you the more act the more you activate it. I wanna accentuate the positive. Which is probably better here. You gotta accentuate the positive. If we play this so we untap one, doesn't seem great. You can still walk away. And I walked away. My daddy gave me a name. Oh, if this just gets to eat this guy, this is gassed. Oh, the post block kill. That's a good one. That's a good one. You gain one life. That's so weird. I gain one whole life. Thanks. Um, alright, so we can play Nissa, untap a land, play Paradise Druid. I think that's not as good as Frilled Mystique. Alright, take it easy, little man. Well, man, not now. Well, I kind of like just playing Elf and Frilled Mystic, though. We lose this, but maybe that's okay. Oh, Andrew said he's here. I'm just going to tell him to come in. Come on in. Come on in, chat mic. Or music mic, whatever your name is. Uh... I actually think we play Manissa here. <laughs> cool. I've seen worse. Cool.
My bag of holding gave me a name. And then he walked away. We need to move quickly. God, I can't wait for these cards to rotate. I cannot wait. It's going to be the most exciting thing ever. Oh, it's not going to play anything? That's interesting. Well, butter my biscuits. We'll find new cards which are miserable. God. You know, it's funny because you're not wrong. Andrew's got a, Andrew broke his femur, so he's, uh, I'm going to counter this just because we have nothing else. Like, I don't want to keep this guy in my hand forever. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We also have a lot of mana for this Hydroid Crassus, so... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wait, one, two, three, four, six, yeah, eight, so we'll do six. Andrew broke his femur! <laughs> Here he comes. That's the song. He's a little... The song is Andrew broke his femur. It's a prank. Yo. I got Wawa and my dad left it on top of the trash can. <laughs> Outside? And I can't get it. I Do have you have a little help. thing? No, I don't have a thing. No, what's your... What? <laughs> Come on this side. What are you doing over there? Let's skip to the oh, it's, a, it's a 7B. That's a nice microphone. Yeah, these are, yeah they're two SM7Bs. Wow. I'm glad you noticed that. Yeah. Look at Andrew with his little crutches. They're little, yeah. They're very little. Oh my... Hey, it's Andrew. I didn't know you were, I didn't know you were a cripple. Like a, a handicap. Yeah, what did you think was gonna happen? I don't know. I thought you were fine. Oh yeah, I broke my leg. So is it is your drink outside? Yeah, it's on the truck. Okay, hold on. I'll go get it for you. <laughs> don't worry. I'll I'll keep them entertained. Oh wow, I can see your stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. So what we're doing is we're playing Magic the Gathering today. Here you can sit with us. And uh, it's we like Magic the Gathering because it involve it's like it's like chess and poker put together. So uh, what I think we should do next is we should untap and draw. I think that's the the good. It's a good beginning of any turn. So uh, while Frank is gone, I would I would recommend that everybody untap and draw. Well, actually, we're just kind of watching Frank play. So Frank probably does it automatically. So I was just telling them that the the first step to any good turn is to, to untap and draw. There you go. So I think the computer has that covered. So providing that it has that covered. All right, I got you some. I got you some food there, Chief. All right. <clears throat> good. So. Oh, good times. Here we are. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and we're here. Visiting Macau, France. Wow. 
What do they have? Three cards? Do you know any of them? No. Why is this stuff all crazy? What? Uh, because this is Arena. Oh, this is Arena. You've been playing Arena lately. Well, I mix it up a little bit. You want to pull your... You probably want to pull your mic down so that... Huh. So that people can hear you otherwise. Yeah, I was like, that's why I was like, we can just use my stuff. I was like, I was pretty sure, no matter what your setup was, like, SM7Bs are probably on par with them, at least. No, yours are better. Oh, interesting. 7Bs are the pinnacle. Yeah, There's they're like, better. yeah, they're the industry standard, yeah. I agree. Uh, if you guys didn't know, Frank takes this seriously. He has really nice microphones, and he's, they're set up so well. There's not much bias in the 7B. It's just good. No, right. It's, it's not like, yeah, it's not like it's like, oh, well, you just got, you got there's just SM7B fans out there. Clean. You're like, no, it's just good. It's just the, it's been just, around for it's just clean, 400 honest years. audio. You know that uh, Michael Jackson recorded Thriller on this microphone. A lot of people have recorded a lot of things on this microphone. People tell that to me, and there's this really weird, obscure band uh, called Thriller. Or they recorded a whole album called Thriller. Who did the band? Wait. Some weird obscure band, and somebody said that to me. You're like, you know, they recorded Thriller on a 7B. I <laughs> and I was like, oh my God, that's my favorite band. And they're like, what are you talking about? And I sent them that <laughs> like, super shit. What do you mean, band? What are you talking about? That's yeah, not how that works. Obscure thing. How you been, buddy? I've been better. <laughs> <laughs> how did you break your femur? A stupid, stupid accident in Nashville. Stupid accident in Nashville. I'll tell you about it later. Um, but yeah, got a little surgery and here recovering in Florida. Oh, they emblemed. Oh yeah, we're done. That's so talk all. Talk to me about arena. What's this all about? What do you What do you want to know? Well, SM Seven Bs are mad. It's all about my hundred dollar Blue Yeti. Blue Yeti's a fine blue microphone. Blue Yeti's a great microphone, especially I, I'm for the not cost. Argue with you there at all. And the Blue Yeti having a USB interface is fantastic. That's honestly pretty. I forgot how smart magic players were. Breaking your femur isn't humorous. <laughs> Fuck. That's good. That's solid. Damn, this monitor rig is great too. Yeah, this monitor is new. This guy takes himself seriously. I like how you, I think you say that every time you come over. Well, because it's nice, right? Like this is your. But I appreciate. Job. I appreciate you noticing. Yeah. You have to have a good. Uh, if you have a good setup, it says that you have self-respect. I agree with that, actually. I mean, like, obviously, I don't think people that like you don't have to start at this. You know, you have to prove right, to but like that this is what you're doing. But I want to, I want to see like a consistent amount of like I want to see your interest consistent. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Like, gradually get better, or like gradually put a little bit into it every so often. You know? Yeah, but I mean, the fact that there's a guest mic that's a seven B. That's. Did you know your audio output is mono? My five point speakers at home only get you out of center. That's interesting. Interesting. I did not know that. I also don't know how to change that. That might be coming through your focus, right? You look good. It does say mono, but like, so the problem is, so the problem is because I have two microphones going through the same, um, what, the like, interface? yeah, the same interface. Like if I don't have it on mono, then you would be in the left channel and I would be in the right channel. No. No, that's how it's... No, that's... <laughs> no? No, that's how it's worked. Like, if I put it on... If I switch it to stereo, um, left mic has been left channel, right mic has been right channel. Oh, really? Yeah. Hmm. So I have to do mono so that it's equal in both. It might be like a... I also haven't messed around with that on a, on a PC... It might be like an internal, like a, like your machine in the settings. Hey, uh, Music Mike, do you by chance do stand up? <laughs> <laughs> I did back rarely, in the day. Rarely. Yeah. Not I so was, much anymore. I was more into it before. It's harder now. Yeah, it's not as easy anymore. Yeah, it's a funnier, funnier crowds are out there. It's just harder to keep up, you know? He doesn't really have a leg to stand on when it comes to that. Mm -mm, no. Nope. So let me see if I can actually change it while I'm on here, and I'll see if I if you guys can experience it. I don't know if I I don't know if it'll change while I'm. Oh, the program really? must be restarted. Yeah, that's what I figured. Okay. Yeah. Bug it. Ain't nobody got time for that. 
So this is arena. This is arena. It's it's more intuitive. Like it's more it's more Hearthstone-y, let's say. Yeah. It look it's much more animated. Aren't we all? So if you don't know the cards though, it's probably gonna be harder for you to keep up. Oh yeah, I don't know what what set is this? Uh, well this is all the sets. This is just standard. Oh okay. This is, oh whoa. Okay, so you're playing standard in arena. Yes, correct. And is it as competitive as like like how competitive is this? Uh, pretty competitive. I mean, it's so like more than like going to an FNM. Probably about the same as like a good FNM. Okay. All right. So like good players are playing on arena. Yeah. Okay, that's cool. I heard that Femur Elementals is a busted deck right now. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh lord. We have a good time. See, this is This is sad because it's like it's hard. I don't know. What do you need from me in order to keep up here? What? what? Oh, just to keep up with yeah, this. Yeah. With what's going on. I don't know. I kind of like I'm kind of just taking a peek at I can move this over here if it helps. I mean, the monitor's so, so goddamn good. But... It's very big. I can move this over here. Not sure. And then we got... Is this Frosty Mike for the... <laughs> no, this is just... This is Andrew. This is... Andrew's been here before. Oh, see, and then we just win. So this is... Oh, I was going to show you Nissa. Nissa's one of the new Planeswalkers in Standard, and she's pretty good. Is that Spark? Or the Spark? Yes. No. Yeah? Yes. Okay. All right. And then they, they did five Planeswalkers for that or more? 36. Oh, fuck. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> was that the set that was all Planeswalkers? Yeah, it was oh, like 36 shit, shit, shit. Planeswalkers. Okay, yeah, so they're just five. Yeah, sounds good. All right. Oh, fuck. It's five. <laughs> like three counter, then pay one target. Oh, oh shit. So, dude, that's a very versatile Planeswalker. Yeah, she's not bad. She wins you the game usually because she just turns all your lands into three threes. Well, okay. you know, one at a time. So is that pretty much what you build the deck around? No, there's only one in here. Mm. But she's just, just she's just very good in standard right now. Okay. Yeah, just give me the rundown of your deck as you play. Just show me your cards. You got your little. He's got his little Wawa mac and cheese, yeah. which is a solid choice. Yeah, I I remember fondly eating mac and cheese here before. They're, oh, that's right. So, oh yeah, that's right. Cause uh. I'm about to bust. Oh wow. <laughs> <laughs> I've been watching so much King of the Hill. That's really? Like, yeah. Oh, that smells delicious. Do you want some? No, I'm good, but I. It's just got. It's a, It's an. I can appreciate the smell. I like that. I've lost so, much already. so this is Vivian Reed. This is a three mana planeswalker. She's a rare. Mm -hmm. Um, and you may cast creature spells though they had flash. This is the static ability. Mm. So oh, yeah. some of the planeswalkers have static abilities now that just do things no matter what. Mm. Uh, plus one until your next turn up to one creature gains vigilance and reach and then negative two look at the top three cards of your library exile one face down put the rest in the bottom of your library so that's a very frank I just grabbed this two. guy that's a very frank negative two ability is it? Uh -huh. why? because it draws a card? you're always sifting <laughs> he's always sifting he likes it he likes it Alexa, tis me. <laughs> okay Alexa stop I don't know why she did that. I don't know why she does anything, I guess. Hunter's here. No. No. I'm too weak for that. He is too weak. Hunter, get out of here. It looked like you were milking a cow when you said I was always sifting. Mm -hmm. <laughs> He's just getting those udders, guys. Yeah. The elves are back in standard? Yeah, there was. Well, this was from Dominaria. I feel like you would have you oh. would have known about that one. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Yeah. Dominaria was fun, actually. I forgot about that. Dominaria was fun. I'm waiting for the Nikaya's Wrath. Narset? I didn't get to play enough of it. Sure. Past, present, and future. Keep an open mind. Oh, I'm a Kaya's Wrath now. Oh. Arena definitely is more animated. Yeah, it that's what they're seems... that's what they're going for. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. So we know they have Kaya's Wrath. Do we just run our wolf into that? Maybe. Probably not. Maybe. Yeah. 
I mean, like, otherwise we don't do anything and they have no reason to Kai's Wrath, so. I don't think we play anything here, though. So they have this in hand, which is destroy all creatures. You gain life, you go to the number of creatures you controlled that were destroyed this way. So oh, it's wow. just a it's just a four mana wrath of God. Interesting. That's cool. <clears throat> Dominary was fun. Also, I can't wait to see these Dominary cards go. Yeah, like so Dominary was great to draft, and the set itself was great. But I think in combination with like War of the Spark, it's just miserable. Really? Yeah, because there's just too many good planeswalkers right now. Mm. Hmm. Oh, here you I'm can so sorry. That. You no, no, you're good. You're wood? good. Do you respect wood? <laughs> That's a solid. Uh... Pretty, 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 pretty good. That's a solid curb reference. Yeah. I love to think that that's what ruined a marriage. Yeah, he's like, eh, do you respect wood? Do I respect wood? They finally get back together. And then that coaster. Yeah. The drink. Well, she didn't respect wood, Andrew. I know. I don't know what to tell you. And this guy's great. This guy's, this is a 4-4 four, for four, 4 with flash. Other wolves and werewolves you control get plus 1, plus 1. And at the beginning of your end step, if you didn't cast the spell, create a 2-2 wolf. Holy shit. Which is actually a 3-3 three, three wolf because of the plus 1, plus 1. Yep. And now it forces The deck you're playing reminds me, like, I don't know how to explain it, but it feels like more old school magic. Um, yeah, and then they're playing a deck that's like New School Magic, where they're like, I'll just kill all your things. <laughs> With Planeswalkers. Oh. So, when you I was in Nashville... Me remember our dear friend Jake? Yeah. Yeah, so I stayed at Jake's house after I got out of Does the Does he live in Nashville? Yeah. What? Yeah, dude, he bought a house in Nashville. That's very strange. He's about to have a child. He's married. He's doing so well. Really? For everybody that doesn't know, Frank and I have known each other for probably 10 years now. And uh, I'm talking about one of our friends from back then. But when I was there, he was telling me about this card. This one? Mm -hmm. Oh, the, the Hydroid. Uh, oh, the Hydroid Crisis. This card's yes. insane. Okay, so explain it to me, though, because he was trying to explain it to me, and I just didn't have enough context around it. So it, the round down seems awkward to me. Okay, well, it's just like, because you can't draw, like, if, if you spend six mana on X, right? Yeah. Drawing six cards and gaining six life is insane. Too much. So you just have it. Like, so if it's five X, if it's five, you're still getting a five five because you don't round down the number of counters it gets. Okay. You only round down the cards and the life. So okay, if so you, you do it for four, five. So you did it for four. Correct. Okay. So, so I drew two, two and gained two. If I do it for five, I'm going to, I'm still going to get a five five, but I only gain wow. two and draw two as well because you're rounding down. And then six will get three. Correct. What is the ideal window to cast that card in? Is uh, it late game? Or usually, I wait till I have about six. Okay. Might be a bad idea. I don't want to really do it for, for less than that because a 3-3 three, three is not super impressive and you're only drawing one card. Well, that's when, the way I was reading it, I was like, that doesn't seem awesome. But then I saw that well, like, like, there's Well, so Muldrifter for five, five mana, right? Muldrifter costs five and it's 2-2. Two, 2-2 two. Two, two, draw a card? Draw two cards. Draw two. So for six mana, for one more mana, you're getting a 4-4 four, four that also gains you two life and has trample. So it's like... For one more mana, it's a lot different. Plus, the flexibility of it's very, very that's, good. That's when I was thinking of it. I was just like, okay, cool. Well, when you cast it higher, that's nuts. And then you still have the flexibility where if you had to cast it low, it's still valuable. Or it's yeah, still Yeah, right, exactly. Like, you can still get a 2-2 two, two for two, for two, for four if you need it. Yeah. And draw one card. We will meet again. Okay. Oh, that's nice. Interesting. Somebody said that depends on the matchup. Like, casting for two is usually fine against red. Yeah, because it gives you a blocker and it gains you a life. So it's it's usually not terrible. Yeah. And you're also not going to have that much time to cast it for, like, six or, you know, whatever. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because, like... I feel like six is kind of the top of like anything viable. No, because in this format you can you can ramp a much like the Nissa that adds an extra green. Oh. So like you can tap you could you'll have like twelve mana and, and do it for ten. Oh, and then that's nuts. Right. 
That's some real F- Frank Lepore shenanigans. <laughs> he loves drawing cards. I do. He's right. I do love drawing cards. I really get to see a live stream and watch on YouTube very much like Golo Stick. Yeah, the Golo Stick was great. Jack Lily, thank you so much for 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 uh, for saying something, man. I appreciate uh, the sub, even though you don't get to catch much. See, like this Nissa, you're like, oh, all my forests slide double green. So right now I could do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. No, ten. So I could do it for eight. It's pretty good. That's pretty good. It's not bad. And it seems like you're. Uh... They're gonna like, Dovin's veto this though. Your mana base seems pretty good. Like it doesn't seem like you get stuck too much. Seems like you have flexibility. No, and this and yeah, this this mana base has been fine so far. Cause what? what well, are... cause you have you have the shock lands right now. Yep. And you have the these like check lands, I think they're called, which are like you know if they enter the battlefield untapped unless you if you control planes or island. Oh, I like those. Yeah, they're good. Yeah. I feel like I should have just kept Frilled Mystic up here. Wait, what's it do when it enters? Uh, counter spell. Oh. It's like Mystic Snake, basically. Oh, that's sick. Only it costs one more green. Instead of one green, blue, blue, it's green, green, blue, blue. Wasn't Mystic sna- uh, Snake weaker? Yes, it was a 2-2 two, two, instead of a 3-2. Let's, Let's try this. Also, this Tefri is super obnoxious. That one went up a bunch in value, right? It's very good. Mm. Oh, good. Well, now I'm feeling real bad about not keeping this full mystic up, but I guess they couldn't Dovin's veto it. Well, that was good. Wait, holy shit, those are still in standard? What, the dinosaurs? Yeah. Yeah. What the fuck? They <laughs> they rotate after M20. Dude, what? I remember playing that set so long ago. Yeah, it feels like a year ago. Don't worry, I got it had to have been a year ago. It probably was close to a year ago, yeah. Okay, just don't... Ixalan? Yeah. It was ages ago. That's still insane. M20 just came out. Yeah. Uh, War of the Spark came out. Guild of, Guilds of Ravnica came out. Ravnica Allegiance came out. Dominaria came out. M19 came out. So, like... And if you consider there's three months in between each of these sets, what is that, six? 18 months? Yeah. So, yeah. The, the Ixalan's been... We've been playing Ixalan for, like, a, two years almost. Oh, my God. That's ridiculous. Let's I get thought rid standard of this. was supposed to be not like that anymore. Um, I I don't even keep I don't keep track. Yeah. Uh, looks like you're on your own now. I like having this guy because we can just block this zombie, and now we can actually just focus on their face. Focus on their face. I feel like there's a. There's a joke there. No, I am not making this up as I go. You feel like there's a joke there? No, is it focus on their face? I don't know. That's just a thing to say, buddy. Okay. All right. All right. How's your has what's so does it do you are you in pain? No. Really? Mm -mm. Did you get surgery? I did. How was it? It's nuts. Do you want to see? Yeah. Break out the break out the photos, the photogs. Um, I'm not trying to ghost people on the stream too. I know that like people are asking what happened, but like, I'll explain to you after. I might have to deal with some attorneys and shit, so I'm just kind of like not stalking right now. Oh yeah, that's fine. Ain't nobody faulting you for that. Uh, but it was really stupid. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So that's one of the, the Whoa, that's that's a that's a that's a gnarly scar, my dude. Two of those. This is hardly my worst defeat. And then I feel like we're doing very well here, especially with uh Frilled Mystic Negate and Night Pack Ambusher here. They put all that in there. Can we show this on Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do it. This is Andrew right now. That's my leg. I got all that stuff in there. I got all that added titanium. Which to me You're is basically a robot now. What happens like when they cremate me? Is there just gonna be like, like some the, bits just... and pieces left? 
<laughs> your old body disintegrates and then there's like metal. There's Here's just his these urn. metal. Uh, we found left. these bits and pieces in there. <laughs> Did you guys want the implants or? <laughs> what yeah. did the family wish to do with the implant remains <laughs> I hope they sell them I hope they melt them down because titanium is expensive like medical grade titanium it's gotta be expensive. yeah you should just keep, you should actually have your family I, I'll take it if you die first okay. and I'll actually put it in a little thing I'll frame it like I'll, and then I'll be like this is my friend Andrew and I'll introduce people to you whenever they come over and you know stuff like that yeah isn't that nuts <laughs> that like that titanium is gonna be with me for a life I also have uh, things in my back from my back surgery. Really? Yeah. Yo, tell me, though. I'm afraid that, like, it just feels weird to me. Like, I have fucking metal in my body forever. It is a weird feeling, yeah. It's a weird... It's 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 kind of surreal. Do you get over it, though? Like, do you um, notice it? That's... Those are the things that I have in my back. Oh. They're like little helper... Wedges. The little helper wedges. That's the actual official term for it. Mm -hmm. Helper wedges. <laughs> helper wedges. What are they targeting? Is there an easy way to see? Just these two things? Liliana and... I can't tell. There's no way to tell. Basilica and Liliana. So they're taking 6, 10. I don't want you to do that. I also don't want you to have Dovin's Vito. So I'll just troll Mystic it. And actually, I don't think you have enough for Kaya's Wrath, so that actually is very good for us. This this card says, uh, choose any number of target creatures and our Planeswalker cards in graveyards. So my graveyard or their graveyard. Uh, this deals damage equal to the total converted mana cost of those cards, and you put them onto the battlefield. Mm. So you're going to be like, I'll take 12 damage and put 12 mana versus worth of Planeswalkers into play. Damn. Also, somebody said, why is nobody talking about possibly flipping the titanium for profit? And I think yes. It should be in my will. Of uh, because because Andrew's it's because it would be too sentimental for me. I mean, I'm just saying. I could have actually pumped this guy and killed them, I think, but I don't know if I'm I don't know if I'm here for that. So if we play this guy, then we have negate up. They just can't win, right? You're playing. Teferi. Oh yeah, we're playing Teferi. 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 Is it Teferi or Teferi? It, nobody knows. <laughs> I like Teferi. Does your back look like Spinal Graft from Tempest? N it's not... No. Not exactly like that, but it's close. I think we just win this game. I think this game's over. <sighs> Hunter's chewing on his bone in the background, in case you guys can hear that. Yeah, it's an SM7B, so it might filter it out pretty <laughs> well. <laughs> That's why I put these on there. That's why I put the fat, the fat mic covers on there. Yeah, they're good. I had the skinny ones on there at first, and they were fine. They, they were great, but I wanted to, like, filter... Because I also have this fan going, so I wanted to, like, try to filter out as much background noise as I could. Mm -hmm. These are pretty directional, too. If you talk right into them... Oh, yeah, if you're off to the side, you can actually... No yeah, you definitely notice when you're not talking straight into the into the mic. The diaphragm? How's your... Did you make the noise? The noise? Some ASMR... <laughs> I'm about to bust. <laughs> That's the meme. Because I'm one step closer to the edge. I'm about to bust. What? I yes, of course, I've saw of course I saw it. Okay, okay, okay. Andrew made a tweet where it was he spliced together the Linkin Park song with the Hank Hill. Oh, that's what they're looking for. Story. They want this Kaya's Wrath to survive, but I'm just going to negate it. And then they're going to feel bad about their life choices. And now they're dead. Mm. That's a lot of oh, yeah. oh. And we're currently 2-0 with this deck. Oh, and I have this cat over here, too. What? Yeah. What's it do? He just sits there. That's dope. Makes some noises. You can hear the purring. Do you want to? Do you want to draft after this? Yeah. Because I, I feel like that'll be more your wheelhouse. I do know the drafting. All right, I gotta play a couple more matches. Yeah, of this. yeah, do it up. I mean, I like, I like our banter. You know. I'm, oh, the banter's the, the banter's, banter's what I'm here for. Yeah. The magic is just uh, secondary. Anyone can play magic, but can, but can you, you banter? banter? <laughs> ah. <laughs> oh Jesus. 
you get to choose your uh, your person, your little avatar person. Yes. Nice. Uh, I don't love this hand, but I'll keep it. Can you hear him? Can you hear him back there? Who else is here? Uh, Felipe and Michael. Michael B. Mike B. Michael B. The Venus. original Mike. The OB, if you will. The OB. Wait, OM? That doesn't sound as good. No, the original B. Remember the time your dad left your food on the, on the trash can? Yeah. Come on, Dad, get it together. Yeah. Snazzy, good games, buddy. Good games. I uh, no offense, but I never feel bad when I beat when I beat Esper Control. How do you stack up to Esper Control? Uh, I don't know. This is only the third match I've played so far. Ooh. Oh, with this build? Yeah. Oh, cool. Was this a deck that people asked you to build, or were you just kind of trying to? No, someone actually sent it to me. Oh, cool. Can Andrew and his cyborg leg go wake up Mike so he isn't late today? That's a good idea. I think is he not awake? We saw Felipe come. How are you getting home? Do you need a ride? Either that or he can pick me up. I can give you a ride. Okay. Either way. I'll give you a ride. We're friends. Okay. What did you what were you saying about food though? You couldn't do food after or something? I no, I probably could if we But it's just my um, mobility, you know? I don't care about all that. Okay. Well I'm just saying like, Do you think you're an inconvenience to me? Well, no, I'm just saying that like I this is my first going out since I'm listening getting back home so i wasn't sure so my my friend and uh, a support of the stream sends me stuff like this mm -hmm. just to keep it just, just he's like here just wear up. this on stream yeah and it's i'm like okay i'll do it but i literally have no idea let me get one ear let's do one ear. here you can have both you know what i'm a generous oh, friend oh, i want to give you both I, ears i thought they were clips i thought they were different well you'd be wrong Oh, that's nice. Yeah, that's good, right? I feel like I already have pretty big ears. <laughs> Wait, you didn't put them on yet, right? Yeah, no. Okay, well. What? <laughs> I can't hear you. It's pretty fun, yeah. Is it? Mm hmm. So you got some, yeah, you got your little glasses over there. Since when do you collect shoes? Uh, since I like wearing them. Look, man, things change around here, okay? You gotta keep up. This guy wears shoes. This guy fucks. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I can right now. <laughs> that was the one question that I didn't ask at the hospital. Was I wanted to, like, like, what do you, like, can I? Do, do so I? So, did, how long I till I can, <laughs> could I, did you, <laughs> does it all, <laughs> how much? <laughs> How long till you? What if I sit on the bot? <laughs> You're like, you know what? Never mind. Just forget it. I'm just gonna sit it out for a little while. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> what happened to Andrew's ears? Is that a side effect from the surgery? Yeah, it's uh. That was just a yeah. That was just a a sad. Oh wow. Oh wow, that's worse. <laughs> yeah, it's it comes and goes. The hearing with the surgery. And the whatnots. I guess we'll do one of these jobbies first. See if we can find anything cool. Oh, that's exactly what I was hoping for. That's a very frank thing to do. Yeah, I agree with you. I'm a very frank person. So. The most frank person. When are we going to cast the, the crisis? Uh, probably next turn. For how much? Probably like a thousand. I want to cast it with a silly amount. A cilium? A cilium. Where's that planeswalker that doubles it? Oh, we have it? Nissa. What do you call him? A cilium? No. We wouldn't need to cast the. Cr a silly amount. A silly amount. Ah, a I gotcha. A cilium. Amount. I see, yeah, you were blending it together. I was like, amount. a cilium? A cilium. Is that, your, is that your elvish home that you live in? Mm. Are you from a cilium? Is that your. A, a cilium out. Ah, a cilium mount. See, out. here you go. Yeah. Yeah, 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 Look, yeah. Chan tra Chad is translating for you. Silly mouth. Yeah. Yes. Exactly. Nailed it. I'm not done yet. I know my responsibility. God, these Teferis. Look, two Teferis at the same time. Wait. I thought you couldn't do that. You can do whatever you want. It's the Wild West right now, buddy. <laughs> Wait, what's the Planeswalker rule right now? Uh, as long as they're not the same name. So Teferi Hero of Dominaria and Teferi Time Raveler. 
So they're just looking at each other, being like, yo, bro, sick, different outfit, even though we're the same person. <laughs> Look, I'm you. Yeah, basically, that's pretty much what it comes down to, yeah. I hate that. That's like saying it's like, well, as if there's a possibility, but yeah, it's totally legal to clone yourself. Just make sure it wears different clothes. Yeah, that's right. Doesn't wear different clothes, you'll confuse people. You know, it's illegal to be a twin in Montana. They don't allow twins in Montana. Huh. You have to separate them in different states so they don't get confused. That's the weirdest thing I've ever heard. Yeah, I made that up. <laughs> <laughs> That's good, though. That's, that's solid. That's a solid makeup there. Yeah. I do not blame you for your, uh, for your involvement in this lie. I practice my fake history quite a lot. I'm really proud of you. Fake facts. Fake FAQs. I know my responsibility. I don't understand what's going on here. No Wait, break. did we cast the big crazy thing? Did I miss it? No, they made us discard it. Okay. They played uh, Thought Erasure, which is they reveal their hand. It's just choose an online card, they discard it. And then you get to surveil one. That's the one card I didn't want us to discard. That's exactly right, and that's why they took it. Sick. Thanks, Project Reborn. I'll remember this. <laughs> a, I won't forget this. Can we draw another one? Can you frank around and sift? I don't think so, man. Why? Uh, I don't want to, uh. mostly. Striking also, we have no way to do that. Hard. God, Hunter's really going to town here. Let's go to attackers. This guy, this guy, this guy, and this guy will go to your face. Okay, so yeah, do that. Give me that solid block. I mean, I don't even know if it's right to like. We could probably just deal a million damage to their face, right? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Like we could probably just kill them in like two turns, but instead, we're hoping we just dodge Kaya's wrath. But I guess we still have two planeswalkers and two creatures. Yeah, it's whatever. Oh yeah, resolve that. And then play this dude and just kill it. That's fantastic. Got him. Alpha Wolf, thanks so much for the bits, buddy. Ha hate to shout out different pizza guys other than Hungry Highs with Domino's doing 50% off their menu items. Is that is that all week? Is that just any Domino's ever? Like oh, well look, we found one. Rat. We got a Hydroid Crisis. Why don't you behold nature's true power, Andrew? I've been trying to. <laughs> I'm working on it right now. You still haven't met Adam, huh? I have not met Adam. He's like been playing some magic. I wouldn't know. I want you guys to meet it so bad. You'd be such friends. I know. I agree. Are we... We were Facebook friends. Did he unfriend me or did he like... He would never. But I don't know if he's... Uh, I don't know if he's much of a Facebook No, we're... Guy. Yeah, we're still Facebook friends on here. Yeah. He's not really much of a social media guy. Then how do you get a hold of people in 2019 when they're not social media guys? That I don't understand. Texting. 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 One, two... I think three, I'm the four, only five. person you text. I'm the only person that isn't on Facebook Messenger. <laughs> right. Well, you message. Yeah. Right. You message me on Facebook or uh, on text, and I'm just like, okay. Mhm. Mm so they're dead now, right? The this looks like 12 damage to me, and they got no cards. So. Texting. Texting. You like the fires of Gondor? That's actually a good idea. a decent blade bro yeah it's i this is the real reason we brought you here to show me your blade no to to take the to finish the femur job i lost my blade on this tour was it a good one no okay well then no one cares but i had it for a long time oh so it sentimental, sentimental. So it was sentimentally good then that's still good 
Well, Jake has it. It's just I wouldn't be able to fly with it. That's the worst, yeah. So. Yeah. Yeah. I do like a good Carnage Tyrant. It's a nice spring to it. Yeah, this is a pricey knife, so I would pricey expect knife. I would expect no less. Yeah, and like the there's a piece that chipped off here, mm. and I just sent it to them, and they fixed it for free, and then I sent it back. So wow, you get that once you spend the good money on the knives, you get the good customer service. Mm -hmm. You light the fires of Gondor and it's a whole to-do. Look at this dog. He's like, what do you got over here, buddy? Like, oh, that's not what I wanted to do. I hate that so much. What happened? I put this into play tapped instead of untapped when I have Atlanta War Elves in oh, hand. Oh, Frank. It's not ideal. We're a turn behind. We're a whole turn behind. <sighs> it's not good. Can we catch up? Never. Disdainful stroke. What kind of knife is it? It is a uh, bench made. I think it's called a crooked mini crooked river, maybe. Mini crooked river. That's right. Look at you, shoe guy. Well, they're just Jordan ones. That's a con. That's like a. Yeah, what are you saying right now? It's a very uh, acceptable, valuable... Oh, it's a classic. Classic. Yeah. It's a good shoe currency shoe to have. It's a what? A good currency shoe? Yeah, like it's like it's it's common currency. Hmm. That shoe. Hmm. I feel like everybody likes a Jordan 1. Everyone does like a Jordan 1. You ain't kidding. It's just a good looking shoe. It's a good looking shoe. Classic. What's that ability that you chose? Uh, until your next turn, you may cast sorcery spells until they head flash. Ooh. Really, the only thing you're using this for is the negative three bouncing a thing, return uh, an artifact creature enchantment to its owner's hand and drawing a card. And the each opponent can cast uh, can cast spells only when they can cast sorcery. So it shuts off like counter spells and stuff. Oh. Uh, so the plus one on it is. And we have three counter spells in hand, so you can see why that would. Uh, be very good against us. So now we can't cast spells. We got our game one though, yeah? That's more like it. We did get our game one. And now we're gonna play this guy. Mm. Your favorite. That's a really good card against a control deck. If it ain't slip on vans, I don't want it. <laughs> Honestly, I fuck with that statement. I'm yeah. a big vans. You big guy. slip on are you slip on vans fan? No, I'm more classics. Just the classics. Authentics. Does it seem a little lackluster to me when your opponent uses their hostage shaker to steal your keyboard elf? Uh, I don't know if it seems lackluster to you, but I, I would say it seems lackluster in general. I like saving the hostage takers for the hydroid crassuses because then you can just recast them for as much as you want. I have three pairs and a fourth with laces. They're good. You're right. You're correct. All right, what do we got? A 4-4 four, four and a 2-3, huh? Well, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. See, now we're playing this guy for 4. What you sipping on? Gin and juice. Lay back. Got my mind on my money. Yeah, my money on my mind. Of course. 
as one does. Well, no attacks here. It doesn't do anything to just trade both of these guys for this guy. Mm. Oh, you casted a crisis. You didn't tell me. I did say. I said I cast it for four here. Oh. You were in text world. Oh, fuck. Okay. I I'm literally sorry. said I it apologize. off. No, I apologize. I don't mind. I don't oh, mind. Well, it's, uh, it's still. <laughs> you mind more than I do. I do. But don't be calling me out for not saying anything when I said something. Well, I just like a good jellyfish casting, you know? It's no crab cast, but... Well, it's a jellyfish Hydra Beast. Anybody That's... playing any crab decks in standard? There are no current crab decks in standard. You should uh, you should make a website called Are There Any Crab Decks in Standard? <laughs> and then when people go to it, you Check, can update how it. How much is that domain? Check that. Are there any crab decks in standard .com? That could be a good magic blog. Oh, I guess I have to go dot com. I think you're good. I think it it's, looks like it's open. It looks like it's open, man. Yeah, of course they have the Kaiser Wrath. We knew they would. I wonder what that domain costs. Is this spells? It's probably only has spells. Probably God, cheap. That's terrible. Let's check. Nobody take this domain while I'm looking, okay? Nobody take the... No one take. Are there any crab decks in standard.com? Did you see that we bought... Uh, you know Rob? You know Rob, who's on the stream sometimes? He's a friend of mine? Uh, yeah. I don't, I don't, don't think lie. I personally know. Don't lie about it. I know that you we have a friend named Rob. We, we ordered robsmom.co. So now when you go here, it redirects to this. sank because they didn't have nearly enough weight in the center and it was it literally had been on the water for 10 minutes and it sank it they should have got they should have got your mom she's got enough weight in the center <laughs> so so that's what rob's mom.co redirects to <laughs> that's good so you guys can go to rob's mom.co and have a good time this one teferi is shutting off all of these cards it's really kind of oppressive nine dollars a year that's not bad a year? Yeah. That's not bad. No. For are there any crab decks in standard? And then it'll always say no until the point where you're like, and then there's going to be that one standard season that has a crab deck, and it'll just say yes, and you'll be like, finally. Just this, Comic Sans, black this is, background. This is what I was waiting for. Yeah, this is my when moment. When it's no, it's in red, and when it's in yes, when it's yes, it's green. And you can have a bunch of sad crabs when it's no, and then when it's yes, they can have party hats on. Oh, yeah. It's living the dream, man. That you Adam would do it. Oh my god, they got rid of their Teferi so I can negate this Teferi, and now all of my disdainful strokes are online. Why they didn't bounce this elf warrior instead, I don't know, but I'm okay with everything that just happened right there. Okay, so now it's they have no cards versus our two disdainful strokes, and I'm here for it. No blocks. Oh, right off the tippity top. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I'm going to do it for six so we can keep up Disdainful Stroke. Uh, fine. Does that make you sad? I just want to cast it for 20. Look at that. It's beautiful. That's pretty good no attacks <clears throat> yeah this card's great it's flying too and trample yeah oh no you got it how'd they get up to 29 uh they gained three from this it when there's about this three damage to any target and you gain three it's basically a lightning helix yeah and they probably played like three of them yeah. oh this card also gains you four life nah i don't know if you're reading it or not I can uh, never what's tell. a mass do? Uh, a mass. Oh, is that? Oh, it's like the little zombie guys. Yeah. So a mass is put. A, it says it on the right. Put four one one counters on an army you control. If you don't control one, make a zero zero. So okay. So make, make a four, four four basically. Yeah. Make a four four. Make a four four. Make a four four. Make a four four. That's a good song. All right. Well, 
The clock is beginning. Dude, magic players are too smart. It's a strong shell. <laughs> that's a that's a little crab humor. What would you be, what would you feel like eating later? I don't know. I'll show for you around, buddy. Well, it's just like where like you know we need to we need to go somewhere where I would be protected and sitting. Oh, you All know, right. like easy, Wait. accessible. Uh, I don't know, man. Idea, yeah. Look at our hand right now. Oh. Also, we just played Teferi and bounced their 4-4, four four, so now they have nothing. We've got a decent amount of power on the board, too. Yeah, wow. and our hand is two counter spells. They're dead next turn. And that's... So is this guess Crab Mike? I guess it is Crab Mike now. Crab Mike, yeah. Handy crabbed Mike. Olive Garden, never safer. <laughs> when you're here, you're safe. <laughs> All right, so we're like 3-0 with this deck, and two of the matches were to Esper. That seems pretty good. It does seem pretty good. What else have you been seeing in Standard? There's Mono Red. There's Mono Blue. It's like a Mono Blue Tempo deck where they play a bunch of 1-1s one and 2-2s, two but then they have a bunch of protection spells for them. That seems miserable. It's pretty obnoxious, yeah. Uh, mono Red seems like a bad matchup for you. Uh, you mean me in general as a human being? No. I would never say that about you. I'm saying about that deck. Hmm. When you move around this risk board, this this clue board, looks like you're in a game of clue right now. Are you talking about this this yeah, that this board? Yeah. It does look like clue actually. It, it looks like clue. Wow. Looks like you're gonna figure out who uh, who did some doings. This looks like the kitchen or something. Yeah. Who did some doings? The case of the, the the dude who did some doings. Who's doing some doings here? I believe it was your mother. Who did the doings? Rob's mom. Co. That's right. That's correct. We got all that land again? What are you saying about my lands? Who? That's the planeswalker we like. No, this is this is Damn a smaller it. one. Oh. What? What? All women planeswalkers look the same to you? No, it's not that. It's just that all green planeswalkers Unbelievable. look the same. Unbelievable. Hunter, be careful. It's messed up. Why don't you be careful? Did you ever think about that? I did. You did? Really? Because you wearing you got two crutches right now, buddy. I'm sort of. You're not even a little bit careful. I'm gonna be careful now. I've seen puppies. What today? No. You from now on. Sure. You think you know a guy, and then he's not even careful at all. <laughs> oh my God! I don't like it. See, they played the Nissa though. That's the one. Nissa who shakes the hand. She does shake the hand. But now we get to play 4-4 four, four for free. Or not for free, but like an instant speed. And block this guy for free. Not and then bad. we get some great attacks against this Nissa. So. Oh, that's a good dude. Toblerone? Tulsmere, friend to wolves. When he enters the battlefield, you get Voya, friend to elves, a legendary 3-3 green wolf, which is a guy on the right. Tie uh, whenever a wolf enters the battlefield under your control, you gain three life, and that creature fights up to one target creature you don't control. Holy smokes. That's a really cool deck. Oh, how much are we going to cast that crisis for? Uh, like 7,000 when yeah, the time can is we right. wait? Can we wait and cast it for 100? It's possible. 100 seems reasonable. We need the Nissa that shakes the hand. <laughs> That shakes the hand. Dude, your hair is out of control right now. Oh. It's it's actually, it's fantastic, but it's wow. very out of control. Yeah, just uh, break your leg, don't wash your hair for a long time. And then you let those natural oils build up? Yeah, and then you're good. I'm a fan. Thank you. This is such a good cat. They're so good. When are they going to finally come out with a Tobler 2? It's been forever. Wow. <laughs> well, you know, if the Tobler 1 isn't broken, don't fix it. You know, that's what I always say. 
What's this cat doing? I'm just being my friend. He's Check never this up. friendly. I found his spot. There's a little kitty cat over here, guys. I'd pick him up, but I need to gain his trust. That's true. He's not going to be like, no, I'm not about that. Oh, look, a 9-9. Nine -nine. Well, that's something, isn't it? Why'd he cast it for so much? Well, because he's a little... He's a shitbag. Apparently. Let's bounce it. Oh. Uh, uh, that doesn't even seem good. It does not. I don't think we have an answer for that, unfortunately. What do you... We have ours. We could cast ours for 12. No, we can't. I don't know why. How would you think we could do that? <laughs> Just a suggestion. It's a good one. It's a good suggestion. Don't get me wrong. All right, yeah. Let's ooh, let's fight it with a bunch of wolves. Uh, that I have no card that makes. That, let's th cast three wolves and have all three fight them. Does that not work? It's nine. How do we do that? You built the deck, Frank. I guess he's right. I guess he's right. We need some ramp, huh? Yeah, nine nine's uh it's a real it's a real problem. We're at twenty one. Right. You're right. We so are at twenty one. We are at twenty one. Which game is this? The bad one. No, what, what game? This is game one. Okay. If that's what you mean. Yeah. I gotta swing by the Home Depot too. The Home Depot. I could probably do that without you though. Yeah. I don't want you to have to hobble around the Home Depot. It's a, it's a big idea. store. Yeah. When is your what's your what's your recovery time? Bro, they told me three months of no weight on. So three months in crutches. Mm -hmm. But. Oh my God! Please draw the deputy of detention. I need a deputy of detention so bad. Let's go. Let's get it. Are you ready? Yeah. That's not it. That's the wrong three mana white blue card. Okay. Come on, we can do it. Yeah, it's really interesting. Actually, oh god, another one. Lost. We didn't do it. It's not looking good here. Twelve, we got like twelve ten. Still not it. I hate that it's a 9-9. Nine nine. They're all tapped? Interesting. 4, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. We can deal 14 damage to them right now, but then we die. So. Now we have two blockers. Block, block, we take 9, 10, 11 if they don't have anything. Because you can play your Crisis just to block if you have to. We have to trample, though, so it's not oh, as fuck. good. Fight on without me. Oh, but this does give reach. Like, she gives a creature reach and vigilance, so it's not completely out of the question. Yeah, that's great. Good catch. Oh, look, another Nissa. How oh, nice. Well, it's okay. They only have one, two, three, four, five. They only have seven cards in hand. They only have seven cards. What could possibly go wrong? I think we just lost. It doesn't seem great. Well, we have two creatures, so we can block four and three, and then we take 12, so... blocks because that's I guess we got a little too greedy. Too greedy I guess. Where that damn nine nine was the problem. Do you have a sideboard? Do I have a sideboard? Yeah. Everybody has a sideboard you friggin' nerd. They allow sideboards in arena? Do they do they have sideboards in this game? Yeah. Alright so we take out one Paradise Druid. Take out two Tefts. Bring in some disdainful strokes. Huh? Yeah, you like that? Sure. Yeah, yeah, you like yeah. that? Do you? Love a good stroke. Yeah? Oh, wow. Don't say that. That's huh. Your doctor didn't approve of that, buddy. <laughs> we'll have this Vivian read. You know what this one does, right? 
Yeah, you could always... Yeah, you could just get on the ladders. Yeah, easy. What if instead of crutches, we replaced them with ladders, and then you put a ladder <laughs> under each arm, and then you just walked around with the ladders? Like a tall one. Like and a, I got a big trench like coat. <laughs> <laughs> and you're like, that's my tall friend. Does that guy have a broken leg, and is he using ladders? No, he's just really Those tall. are his legs. Excuse me. Wow, look at this hand. If this was poker, I'd keep this all day. Oh, you got this full house. You got Tulsimir's over night pack ambushers. Oh, mulligan, though. Oh, did you know about the new mulligan roll? No, but I see seven. So you go to seven, and then you put one from the from the, from your hand on the bottom. Whoa. And then if you mulligan again, you go to seven, and then you put two on the bottom. So you get to basically sculpt the best six-card hand from this. That's kind of cool. It's pretty nice, yeah. So we're going to go turn one, elf, turn two. I'm going to actually get rid of the deputy. I think, I think this guy's better with this hand. All right. All right. Okay, I'm listening. Uh, my name is Andrew, and I uh, broke my little femur because I was on tour with my friends, and then I was uh, I was in the mosh yeah. pit, and then I hurt my little leg. Uh, I wasn't on tour. And did you break it off off the job? Yes. How did you do this? We'll talk. Is it is it secret? I just uh, I might have to deal with some oh, so, shit. Yeah. Okay. So yeah. Um, yeah, it really sucks, though. That tour was my favorite. Who were you on tour with? Carly Rae Jepsen. That's a big deal. I know. That's big time. Yeah, she's awesome. Who else? Is anybody else there? It was just her headline tour. There was a support band called Mansion Air. That was cool. Never heard of Mansion Air. They're from Australia. And then Phoebe Typical. Ryan was going to join. She's so good. I'm so sad. So sad. Yeah, you done messed up. I know. I know. Could you leave the deck up after this game for a little so I can screenshot it, send it to my buddy to deck the thing on your record? Yes, I can do that, sure. You got it. So what happened when you left? Did you have to did they have to fill did they have to find someone else? Yeah, so luckily. It happened in Nashville, and a lot of touring people live in Nashville. So you, you couldn't get any more hot chicken afterwards, I bet? No. It was too hot. It would have <laughs> wounded the leg more. Once uh, you get that chicken in your... Once you get the hot chicken in your bloodstream, it's all it's, downhill. It's a real crazy... It's, it's a crazy thing. It's a wild and a wacky thing. All right, so the other two cards are Carnage Tyrant and Time Raveler for those screenshotting here. And if you can't screenshot it in time, just clip it. And then you can screenshot it. Then you get all the time in the world. Clip it? Yeah, on Twitch. You make oh. clips. You know, you know how clips work. Of course. Of course I do. He doesn't know. All right, go on, though. You were telling the story. About, you doing okay? Yeah, I'm just shifting. You want a pillow? Uh, For your little butt? Oh, yeah, maybe. Do you? Yeah. Okay. I'll you have, like, it. a nice, like, a sitting pillow? I probably could get a sitting pillow for you. Yeah. yeah. Let's do it. Yeah. All right, hold on. Yeah, go go, go get one. That would be terrible, right? Can you imagine? Let me play this first turn, and then I'll uh, I'll go while it's oh, on their yeah. turn. I mean, I'm not, it's, it's not pressing. It is. We could. We it's could. literally pressing. It's a literally. It's an issue of, mm. of one object pressing against another. It's well, a literal it, pressing uh, issue. Well, it's it was sort of. Pressing. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna go get Andrew a butt pillow. And then there was us. Yep. Mm. Mm. Oh yeah, it's a nice. Uh, it's got a nice flute to it. Yeah, it's got a. It's got a. It's it's thick. <sighs> Loof. Oh. Can you put it on? <laughs> <laughs> if you sit, yeah. If you stand up, I'll just. Yeah. I'll toss it onto your bottom. Mm -hmm. There you go. There we go. There we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's the good stuff. 
That's the good stuff. Hi, Dogo. I want to, like, greet him and tell him how excited I am, but I don't want to get him too excited. Way. Music Mike, how are you on tour with Carly Rae Jepsen? Are you in a supporting band, or was it like tour management? Uh, I was with Carly Rae. Uh, I ran her VIP program. So not the... I didn't play in her band or anything, but I was with like her crew. Her crew is 17 people. So it was a whole bunch of us. It's a lot. A whole little family. Thick Most pillow. Wounds can heal. TP, if you will. Oh, yeah. I pooped on my own today. <laughs> <laughs> that was quite the accomplishment. God, he's so grown up. It's amazing. Yeah. You know what? You know what I think about that pillow. Mm. Damn, boy, he's thick, boy. That's a thick ass boy. Damn. That's the pillow. Such a good soundboard you've built. Yeah, I'm a fan of the ones we got here. Are you, have you seen Mad Men? Yeah. Not great, Bob. That's a, that's a good one. So if you're like, man, how you doing, man? And they're like, not great, Bob. I always survive. <laughs> not great, Bob. I always survive. Those were unrelated, though. Enter tapped. Huh? No attack. <laughs> Did you like that? Yeah. Meh. How's your pillow? Is it better? Better. Don't fart or anything, though, because I, I put my head on that, you know? Okay, I won't fart. I appreciate that. I mean, you can fart in general. If you really got to fart, if then, I, I'll you know. stand up to fart. I'll stand up and I'll, like, air it out. Yeah. God, you're just... You're, you're really kind. You're kind. You've you got the pillow. <laughs> your generosity is really what keeps our friendship alive, I think. Thank you. I wish we no. were playing mono red. Thank you. Do mono, you really? Mono red. Well, I don't know, just because I want to know how that matchup goes. Have I seen Thorn Lieutenant? Do I know that card? Maybe? I'm 19. Oh, cool. Oh, wow, that's great. I kind of want to clip that, but I also feel like maybe what's over. Wait, what was the. Well, what did you want to clip? I don't think it was anything rude to. Give me my little wolf boy. Give me that wolf boy. <laughs> That's a good song. Yeah. I can see why you're on tour with Carly Jepsen. <laughs> you know. They said, hey, we need somebody that can uh, do something completely non-music related. We need, we need someone to sing like Give Me That Wolf Boy. Yeah. And I think you're it. Who can run a VIV program and also sing Give Me That Wolf Boy? And you were like, I can do it. I'm the guy you're looking put, for. Put me in, coach. Uh, I'm oh, I pooped on my own today. Yeah, you clip it. <laughs> <laughs> it's great. Hey, man, that's an accomplishment. Don't, well, don't he's not ashamed of his accomplishments. No, I'm very I'm very proud of that. You think he got all this way in life without being without able to being able to poop on my own? <laughs> what are you crazy? Goodness. Poop on my own. Uh-oh. Hmm. I don't want to fight anybody. I don't want to fight nobody. I don't want no trouble. Can you fight your own stuff? No, that sounds terrible. I'd rather just fight zero. Oh, you can do that? I can do whatever I want. I'm an adult. That's great. Thank you. Yeah. Pics or it didn't happen? Did you take any pics of yourself pooping on your own? Oh. Did you gram it? Did you put it on the gram? No. Well, no. it's messed up, dude. What, I mean, it would look like any other poop. Or like I guess like me pooping like it was like a whole no. I was honestly like too stoked to even think about it. Did you say you're too stoned to think too about stoked. it? Too stoked. God, he was poop. He was so he was so stoned when he was pooping. It was unbelievable. That was actually kind of annoying. Uh, How stoned you were? No, throughout the whole process, I'd have like friends that would hit me up and they'd be like, "Dude, so glad you're okay." Like, 
yo, like, wish you smoked weed. Like, you'd be going through this so much better. And I'm like, yeah, but I don't. <laughs> but here we are. <laughs> Did you make sure to let them give you the good drugs? I'm like, oh, nah, man. I, I didn't really have a choice. They just prescribe what they prescribe. Yeah. No, I didn't take I didn't take any oxys or anything. I, I usually don't either just because I don't like prescription medication that's that strong. Yeah. Yeah, no. I did it all on Tylenol. When, uh, is there, so there's no pain now, though? No. Mm -mm. It feels, like, weird sometimes. Like, I can feel that it's healing, but it's not, like, it's not, like, pain. Would you like to see what's left of us? Come on. Oh, yeah, give me that. Give me that fat wolf. Are we going to win again? I feel like we, he gets stoned when he's on the pot. <laughs> <laughs> Solid. Are they casting one? Yeah, but they only did it for three. See, you can tell. Like, they drew one card. It's a 3-3. Three, three. Nobody cares about that We nonsense. don't care about that. We're trying to do it for 100. This is what I'm saying. Come on. Come on, Jade Light Ranger. You know you want to. Yeah, there you go. Uh, let's make this guy. And we'll double block. I'll trade one thorn loose end for a Jade Light Ranger. I love Oxy. Recently suffered a severe pulmonary embolism. Couldn't breathe without that stuff. Yikes. Damn. I mean, that sucks. And I totally understand why you'd use it. But I don't know if I'd go so far as to say I love it. Yeah. I mean, I get it. I definitely get it. And if you if you can't heal, like, you can be in so much pain that you can't relax enough to heal. And, like, that's bad. But for me, I was fine. And I was, like, really sad because I was leaving my favorite tour I've ever done. So I was like, Rightfully I, so. I don't want to be really sad and then have a very accessible painkiller. Right. That's a bad combination. Yeah, you're like, hey, I'm depressed and I have Oxy here, so. Yeah. Yeah, that seems good. What could possibly go wrong? Yeah, right? But no, like, a, a, what, a wee? Today's Wednesday? Thursday? So it's been, it's like a week and a half since the surgery. And how, then, how long have you, when did you get here? When did you get home? Ooh, Sunday. Oh, so like recently? Yeah. Oh man, so I, I heard from you like right away. Yeah. What a time to be alive. Yeah, I like you. I like you too, man. You're my friend. God, I love our. That's great. Our friendship is good. You're the first person I've seen in Florida, outside of my parents. That's crazy, mm -hmm. man. This is good times. Mm -hmm. And I got to hear about you finally shitting. This is great, dude. I'm really I like. I know. I couldn't ask for anything else. It's a little itchy. I can feel like the the wounds healing, but that's not. That's normal though, right? That's what do you, what can you do about that? Nothing. Nothing. Where'd our crisis go? Oh no, we, we didn't. We have never one. had one. God, you are so you have crisis fever. I do. You're like I saw a crisis. Was <laughs> I it saw, ours? I saw a crisis. I guess we'll take three. I don't know what their I don't know what their game is here. They didn't do anything? Hmm. I'm very confused. Are they gonna do something now? Are they gonna kill this guy, my little wolfie? My little wolfie? He's scratching his leg right now. He's got a little itch. Had a little itch. He did have a little itch. I was given morphine when I dislocated my ankle in Honduras a few years back, and I can absolutely see how easily it is to become addicted to it. Damn. So when I had back surgery and I was in the hospital, the following days, I have really fond memories of them, like, in the hospital. For some reason, like, that's a pleasant memory for me, and it's really weird because I was in the hospital and I was recovering from a surgery. And I'm wondering if the medication I was on, like the prescription medicine I was on, had an effect on that. You know what I mean? Oh, weird. Like if it left me with a more positive memory of that time. I mean, yeah, like if you were taken out of pain. I don't know. When did you have that? Ten years ago. Oh, whoa. It was ages ago. And you've held up well? Yeah. That's awesome. I'm good to go. That's awesome. I'm G2G, as the kids say. I'm just gonna get rid of this guy. I don't feel like dealing with this. This crisis shenanigans.
Yeah, no reason to not play the land either, so. It'll be one more land for our crisis. That's right. We just need to draw one. Young Graham, now that you mention it. What is Young Graham? Oh, Young Graham? What, what does that mean? Maybe a user? Now that you mention it, I think you're onto something. Tulsmere should be have a flavor text that says friend to wool. Oh, someone said. Oh, a Young Graham. Friend to elves, not to jellyfish. Should be game, right? Six and nine, 10, 11, 12, and you're at 11. Wow, this deck is unbeatable, guys. This deck has been fantastic. I'm surprised at how good this deck is. Mm -hmm. If it was medication that activated a bunch of endorphins, that body will 100% remember it as a positive experience. That's interesting. Yeah. Wow, that's crazy. Bodies are crazy, dude. Bodies are fucking crazy. Thank you guys for hanging out. I am not leaving if you're watching on Twitch, but if you're watching on YouTube, this deck was sweet. I didn't have to make any changes to it. We had like 4-0. Definitely give it a try if you are uh, in the market for that. You can check me out at coolstuffinc.com. I had an article go up yesterday about Dracuseth and Standard, so check that out. Use promo code FRANK5 to get 5% off. You can also check me out at manatraders.com. With the promo code and the link in the description, you'll get 20% off the first three months of any subscription, so check that out. Slam those like and subscribe button, guys. I will see you next time.